Hey everyone. Good morning, good evening from wherever you are in the world. I'm Selena with Lead Live Learn. And a few times a month, I post a blog and critique leadership development and personal development books. Those blogs have more details on key messages, high level concepts, the book's areas of strengths and where it falls short. I give an overall assessment ranking from one to 10 on its effectiveness for uh, readers to apply lessons in real life. Those blogs can be found on www.leadlivelearn. But how do you know when to pick up one of the millions of business and self-help books out there? Well, let me tell you, let's get started. The book for today's critique is Humble Inquiry by Ed Shine. Unfortunately, he passed earlier this year in 2023. He was 94 years old, but he was a giant in the field of organization development. So when do you pick up Humble Inquiry? If you are interested in how to listen better and how to ask questions you don't know the answer to. Right? What is that? Ed Shine says that asking versus telling is a fundamental issue in human relations. He defines humble inquiry as the fine art of drawing someone out, of asking questions to which you don't already know the answer to, and working on building a relationship that's based on curiosity and true authentic interest in the other person. You think actually being curious about another person and not what that person can do to you, I think it's a phenomenal concept that we should all practice in our daily lives. So I highly recommend this book and I ranked it an eight out of 10. He's clear, concise, and there's no room for misinterpretation. However, there are seven facets to his framework, three different kinds of humility and four different types of inquiry to make humble inquiry. And so that can be hard to remember sometimes. Happy reading.